This video is sponsored by bootcamp.com. Check it out for INBDE prep and use coupon code MENTALDENTAL for 10% off. Hey everyone, Dr. Ryan here coming to you from the sunny Carolinas. And today's topic is going to be DDS or DMD, which is the better dental degree. Guys, if you like the content, please like this video, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, and share it with your friends. So if you're applying to a certain dental school or you're already attending a dental school that awards a certain degree, you may be wondering, does it matter if I get a DDS or a DMD degree? Is one better than the other? And the short answer to that question is simply no, but there are some small differences that I want to talk about in this video, so let's get right to it. Now, in the medical world, an MD degree is a whole lot different than a DO degree in terms of training, career opportunities, and salary potential. But unlike medicine, dentistry has one accrediting agency for all the dental schools in the United States. And that's called CODA, the Commission on Dental Accreditation. So that means every dental school in the U.S. has to follow certain standards in their education of students. And that means someone who graduates from a DDS program will have the same academic and clinical training as a graduate from a DMD program. So that begs the question, why are there even two dental degrees if there's no difference between them? Well, to answer that question, we have to take a trip back in time to 1840, when the first dental school in the world opened, which is now known as the University of Maryland School of Dentistry. Now, this was the origin of the Doctor of Dental Surgery, or DDS degree, and subsequent dental schools also gave a DDS. It took 27 years for this to change. In 1867, a dental school opened in Massachusetts, now known as the Harvard School of Dental Medicine. Now, Harvard is a very prestigious school, has a reputation of attracting the brightest students in the world, and they do things a little bit differently. And I mean, no disrespect by that. So one of those differences is they grant all of their degrees in Latin. So they needed a suitable Latin name for their dental degree. And unfortunately, the Latin translation of DDS was not very good. So they decided to modify instead their current medical degree, Medicinae Doctoris in Latin, or MD for short, to Doctoris Medicinae Dentariae, or DMD. The English translation of that is Doctor of Dental Medicine. But the degree letters follow the original Latin, hence why it's a DMD and not a DDM degree. Since then, new dental schools had the option of choosing whether they want to grant a DDS or a DMD degree. So all that to say, there's no salary difference between DDS or DMD. One is not more prestigious than the other. One is not more competitive for residency than the other. One's not more difficult to attain than the other. And one is not more expensive than the other. You get the idea. The only true difference then is the history behind each degree name and the amount of schools that provide both degrees. Currently, 31 dental schools provide a DMD and 38 dental schools in the US provide a DDS. So theoretically, the DDS degree will be a little bit more common. So guys, that's the video. I hope you liked it. I loved doing it from the sunny Carolinas. This is Dr. Ryan, and until next time, we'll see you in the next video. That's it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. Please like this video if you enjoyed it, and subscribe to this channel for much more on dentistry. If you'd like to support me, please check out my Patreon page. And thank you to all of my patrons for their support. You can unlock access to my video slides to take notes on and practice questions for the board exams. So go check that out. The link is in the description. Thanks again for watching everyone. I'll see you in the next video.